Hi everyone. Um, so I thought about making a sort of a different video um, because I wanted to call this um, like kind of my thesis uh, check-in or or walking you through like a really real, um, really just me talking unedited. Um, just because I think it's important that I get a lot of that realism across and then when I, t I find that when I tend to edit a lot you kind of create this persona that isn't as real as how I am on a day-to-day -day basis so I wanted to do that um, also because I think it would be good to stay accountable for myself in the last couple of weeks of thesis um, and really kind of remember it and see that journey when I look back on it in 10, 20 years. So I wanted to start like this, this little thing, just walking through my process of where I'm at with the, with the workload, uh, what I need to do, what I've done that I said I would do and, and see if I stay true to, to doing what was planned, but also seeing that organic growth of how the work is right now, how it was before and how it, will definitely change from what I see today in the final version. Um, so yeah, this is kind of like, I don't know how many weeks right now I have before the end, but I know that photo shoot is coming up on, um, I'm scheduling it April 14th tentatively. Um, I went to upstate New York for two days. Um, and we went to the Catterskills, or the Catskills, but I like the Dutch pronunciation, or the Dutch version more. Um, but the Catskills, we camped for a night in, like, freezing conditions, my pal, Krista and I, and there was a lot of, like, 40, 30 mile an hour winds. Um, but I also rode a horse for the first time, and felt like what that was like which is really cool um i saw what it meant to like actually be able to see this creature and have it like it had its own life and its own interpretations of you the rider um and it, it wanted to it, like it had a bunch of these emotions but it also needed you to be the leader um of that creature and so I thought like that with, with what I was doing so far, which you'll hear more about later um, in my collection, but it's pretty much this Western themed with the hint of that 20th century classical, like black tie uh, tailoring. I really went more into the products this year and I feel like, yeah, I changed the channel name to Bagged. Um, I think I really wanna go into bags and the leather work that I just started to do last semester has been really fun um and bags and shoes and maybe a hat or a glove um has really been speaking to me lately in a way that like it just it comes easier and i feel more excited about it right now um and yeah i mean that that leather world is it, it's opened up so much for me so really been focusing on those products um, but we still have a five look collection, um, all garments sewn by me, um, my little intern. Um, and so we have five garments, three bags, two shoes, a hat, um, and two gloves, maybe three. So that's where we're at so far. Um, I have a couple of them sewn or in the process of being sewn in final fabric. Um, and uh, a lot of work ahead so it'll be uh, it'll be a fun process but I think as time goes on and the more days I spend thinking about what the next step is <clears throat> and I'm like okay well, my voice really changed there um, the more it makes sense and it feels like even though I don't know where that end product is in the collection or what that actual story is yet, um, the more days I spend 
in this process, the more clear that end vision becomes. Um, so as the day move or as the days move on, you'll hear more about where I'm at with the process and and uh, you know what that story is that I'm trying to tell and what those physical products manifest into. So that's what I wanted to say. Um, yeah, there are a couple things, you know, specifically that I wanted to dive into as well, but I think this, I'll keep this as an intro video to that, like, weekly series. Yeah, mostly. just want to, like, be able to talk um, and kind of remember this process, because it's only once. Probably not going to go back to school after. Um, and I want to do justice to the work that I could create in my last year, my last semester, um, and hold myself accountable to doing that. So yeah, more of these will come. It's also simple for me to post. So then, you know, if I don't miss the deadline or if I don't miss a week, then I'm not gonna spiral and, and forget about this whole thing. So it's more for me than for you, but if you wanna see that more, it'll be coming. <laughs>